we're driving in western Utah, part of the Great Basin, the high desert. This kind of expedition requires uh, a lot of driving, a lot of driving on dirt roads. Some of them are more exciting than others. Driving on roads like this is definitely an adventure. Oh, this sucks. You have to be prepared and just know that unexpected things are gonna happen. Sorry, we just overshot it. Cool, cool, no problem. Being out here allows us as geologists to really have great access to the rocks, but it's not easy to get to. You have to pack a lot of gear because several nights will camp out of town and pack everything with us, including water, tents, food, everything you need to survive for a couple days. I think it's some of the best part of the field expeditions. You get to a spot that is far away from anybody. You set up your tent, you make a nice meal. Sometimes it takes a couple hours. You sit around the campfire. You get to see stars in a way that you don't usually get to see back home. I think cooking is part of the fun. And so we make things like chili and fajitas and curries. We try and do a lot of canned foods. We bring spices and all sorts of things to make the food delicious. And I think it's important after a long day in the field to have something to look forward to back at the campsite. A lot of people think that camping is just torturous and roughing it and all inconvenience. But when we do camping, we make it as comfortable and as fun as possible. I feel very fortunate to have this job. It is definitely work preparing and even being out here on an expedition like this. There are a lot of logistics, even finding the localities, getting there, packing, unpacking, repacking, managing supplies and things like that definitely require a lot of attention. But all the space around that is, I think, magical. And I just feel so fortunate that I get to, to be out here and, and do this as part of my job.